The highly anticipated second installment of The Queen Wu is set to premiere on September 12, 2024, and fans are eagerly awaiting the return of this captivating series. The release of a new poster has only heightened this anticipation, featuring John Jong Seo as Queen Wu He, ready to face the chaos and challenges that lie ahead. The image of Wu He, with a bow and arrow drawn, symbolizes her transformation from a royal figure into a determined warrior, embodying strength and resilience. Her journey in this season is expected to be more intense and complex, as she navigates through a treacherous landscape filled with enemies and allies alike, all vying for control of the throne. Set against the historical backdrop of Goguryeo, the Queen Wu explores themes of power, loyalty, and betrayal. The series captures the essence of a turbulent era, where political machinations and personal vendettas intersect, creating a web of intrigue and conflict. Part 1, which premiered in August 2024, ended on a gripping cliffhanger with the sudden death of King Nam Mu, portrayed by Ji Chang Wook. His unexpected demise has left the throne vulnerable and Wu He in a precarious position, setting the stage for a dramatic power struggle in Part 2. The tension is palpable as viewers are left wondering who will emerge victorious in the battle for the throne, John Jong Seo's portrayal of Queen Wu He has been a standout. Showcasing a character that is both fierce and vulnerable. Her transformation into a warrior in Part 2 is not just a physical one, but also an emotional journey that delves into the depths of her resolve and determination. Wu He is a character who refuses to be a passive victim of circumstance, instead, she takes control of her destiny, even if it means waging war against those who threaten her rule. This evolution is compelling to watch, as John Jong Seo brings a nuanced performance that captures the complexity of a queen who is both a ruler and a fighter, the addition of Lee Soo Hyuk as Gobal Ji the primary antagonist, adds a new layer of intensity to the series. His character is a formidable force. Driven by ambition and a desire for power that rivals Wu He's own determination. Gobal Ji's presence looms large over the narrative, as he represents the external threat that Wu He must face. The clash between Wu He and Gobal Ji promises to be one of the most exciting elements of Part 2, with each character bringing a different strategy and motivation to their pursuit of the throne. Lee Soo Hyuk's portrayal of Go Bal Ji is expected to be chilling and intense, capturing a villain who is both charismatic and ruthless. The series also delves into the complexities of loyalty and friendship through the character of Yul Pa So, played by Kim Mu Yeol. As Wu He's closest confidant, Yul Pa So stands as a beacon of loyalty amidst the chaos. His unwavering support for the queen adds emotional depth to the narrative, highlighting the personal bonds that are tested in times of crisis. Kim Mu Yeol's performance brings a quiet strength to the role, offering a counterbalance to the intense political drama that unfolds. Yul Pa So's relationship with Wu He is one of mutual respect and deep trust, making his role crucial in the unfolding events of Part 2. The new poster for The Queen Wu Part 2, released on September 3, 2024, perfectly encapsulates the heightened stakes of the upcoming episodes. It features John Jong Seo in a commanding stance, her eyes filled with determination and her bow ready to strike. This visual representation of Wu He's unbreakable resolve is a powerful reminder of what is at stake. It builds anticipation for the battles to come, not just in terms of physical confrontations, but also the psychological warfare that plays out among the characters. The poster's dramatic imagery serves as a promise of the intense episodes that lie ahead, filled with action, suspense, and emotional turmoil. The ending of Part 1 left viewers with numerous unanswered questions and a thirst for more. The sudden death of King Nam Mu has thrown the kingdom into disarray, and Wu He's quest to reclaim her throne is fraught with danger. Part 2 is expected to explore this journey in greater detail, highlighting the complexities of leadership and the sacrifices required to maintain power. Wu He's path is not an easy one, she must navigate a minefield of betrayals, shifting alliances, and constant threats to her life and reign. This season promises to be a test of her strength, both as a leader and as a warrior, as she fights to protect her legacy and secure her place on the throne, adding to the anticipation for part 2 is the news that John Jong Seo will next be seen in the noir thriller Project Y, a crime drama about a grand heist, where she will co-star with Han So Hee. This project marks a departure from her role in The Queen Wu, showcasing her versatility as an actress. In Project Y, John will take on a completely different challenge, portraying a character involved in a complex web of crime and intrigue. This upcoming project has already generated excitement among fans, eager to see her transition from a historical drama to a modern thriller. 
However, before Project Y hits the screens, all attention is on the Queen Wu Part 2 and the dramatic developments that are set to unfold. As the premiere date approaches, the excitement for the Queen Wu Part 2 continues to build. The series has successfully captivated audiences with its rich storytelling, complex characters, and stunning visuals. Each episode promises to add new layers to the narrative. Keeping viewers on the edge of their seats. With a talented cast led by John Jong Seo, the stakes are higher than ever, and the battle for the throne of Goguryeo is just beginning. Fans are ready to embark on this thrilling journey once more, eager to see how Queen Wuhi will navigate the challenges that lie ahead and what surprises the new season will bring. Anticipation for the Queen Wu Part 2 There is significant excitement and anticipation surrounding the release of Part 2 of the Queen Wu, set to premiere on September 12, 2024. The release of a new poster has heightened this anticipation, suggesting that the upcoming episodes will be intense and filled with dramatic developments. Transformation of the main character The narrative focuses on Queen Wu He, portrayed by John Jong Seo, who undergoes a significant transformation from a royal figure to a fierce warrior. This character development is central to the storyline, as she battles to reclaim her throne following the sudden death of King Nam Mu, themes of power, loyalty, and betrayal, the series explores deep themes of power struggles, loyalty, and betrayal against the historical backdrop of Goguryeo. The storyline involves complex characters and shifting alliances, which adds depth to the narrative and keeps viewers engaged, complex character dynamics, characters such as Go Ball Ji, the primary antagonist played by Lee Soo Hyuk, and Yul Pa So, Wu Yi's confidant played by Kim Mu Yeol, contribute to the narrative's complexity. These relationships and conflicts drive the plot, highlighting the tension and emotional stakes in the fight for the throne, John Jong Seo's versatility as an actress, John Jong Seo's performance as Wu Yi is highly praised, and her role in the Queen Wu showcases her range and depth as an actress. Additionally, her upcoming project, Project Y, demonstrates her ability to take on diverse roles, moving from a historical drama to a modern crime thriller, high stakes and dramatic cliffhangers, the first part of the series ended on a cliffhanger, leaving the kingdom in chaos after the king's death and setting up a high-stakes battle for the throne. This narrative strategy keeps viewers engaged and eager for the continuation in part 2, visual and emotional intensity, the imagery and storytelling promise a visually and emotionally intense experience, with dramatic battles, strategic power plays, and the personal growth of the characters, John Jong Seo, also known as Rachel Joon, is one of the most promising young actresses in South Korea today. Born on July 5, 1994, in Seoul, South Korea, John has quickly established herself as a dynamic and versatile actress who brings depth and intensity to every role she takes on. Her journey into the world of acting is remarkable, marked by a swift rise to fame, critical acclaim, and an expanding international presence. Known for her bold choices and captivating performances, John Jong Seo's career trajectory is a testament to her talent, dedication, and passion for the craft of acting. Growing up, John Jong Seo spent a significant part of her childhood in Canada, which gave her a unique cultural perspective that would later influence her acting style. She attended high school in Canada, where she became fluent in English, a skill that would prove advantageous in her later international endeavors. John returned to South Korea for her college education, enrolling at Sejong University to study film. This decision marked the beginning of her journey into the world of acting. Unlike many actors who start with minor roles or through extensive theater work, John's entry into the industry was both sudden and impactful.